boys and girls, Mrs. Davis here. I'm going to read a story to you today. It's called Mr. Little's Noisy Car. Richard Fowler is the author of the book and he also is the illustrator. So he writes the words and draws all the pictures. Now, do you remember this is called the cover? And this is the binding of our book. It holds our book together. And this is the back of our book. So we're going to start our story, Mr. Little's Noisy Car. Mr. Little had a very noisy car. He heard a knocking and growling and sound coming from the engine. So he opened the hood and found a lion and a woodpecker. He heard a whistling and grunting noise coming from inside the car. So he opened the front door and found a grizzly bear fast asleep. Scratching and squeaking sounds came from the back seat. So Mr. Little opened the rear door and found Five field mice hiding from a cat. Let's count the mice. One, two, three, four, five. Good job. Then we heard a muffled mumbling sound coming from the back of the car. So he carefully opened the trunk. And he found an elephant trying to get out. A hissing sound came from one of the wheels. So he jacked up the car and he took the wheel off and found a long brown snake wrapped around the axle. Finally, Mr. Little got into the driver's seat, turned the key in the ignition, and guess what he heard? Nothing at all. So, the woodpecker, the lion, the bear, the five field mice, the cat, the elephant and the snake gave Mr. Little's car a big push. And with a growl, a knock, and a grunt, a whistle, a squeak, a rumble, a thump, a hiss, and a very loud bang, away we went. That's the end of our story today. I hope you enjoyed it. See you soon. Bye.